Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded Dead God Plus series. We're jumping in again. Let's randomize our character, see who we might get. And today, Lazarus again? Are you kidding me? Lilith again? Are you kidding me? Tinted Apollyon again? Are you kidding me? Normal Azazel. <laughs> I just rolled the birds until I got something that I kind of wanted. I want an easy run today. Somewhat easy run. Also, we haven't played this guy much at all. Because. Because, 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 because of the wonderful things he does. No. Because. Today is quite the day in the UK. I, I've, as, as a lot of you will probably already know, that I normally have a pretty healthy backlog when it comes to Isaac. That has um, since diminished just due to various, by the way, this room is a nightmare. Just due to various factors, that's kind of diminished. It's now a, a three video backlog rather than what is normally a week to two weeks. But that the reason I'm telling you this is because what, you're, what I'm telling you only will have happened a few days ago rather than like a week ago. Um, and that horrible, horrible thing that's happened, I'm so annoyed I got hit here. That is truly tragic. I was not wanting to use my full card there, but there you go. Um, yeah, it's today has been the hottest day in the UK that has ever been. This is the hottest day the UK has literally ever had in the history of everything. It was 40 degrees in the UK today. Bear in mind, British people generally consider anything over around 18, 19 degrees to be hot. And it was 40 today. It, 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 it's going to plummet back down to um, the 20 tomorrow. So it's only been for like Monday, Tuesday. It's Tuesday today. But my God. So brain's a bit scrambled. Like, like truly, truly scrambled. Um, and I'm just gonna go with um, go with a question of the day that I received. Someone someone wanted me to ask my Discord. It is one that I've asked before, but it was a while ago. Uh, for any of you that have already asked this question or feel like you've already asked this question, I'm gonna do this because I want the two pennies. Um, if, if if you feel like you've already answered this question, just go for your second favorite. What is your favorite game and why? Um, after your run ends, there are items from inventory. I spawn on the floor where it ended. They can be collected in the next run by getting to the same floor. Kind of interesting idea. Um, I kind of more so just am happy with the speed. Um, but yes, what is um, what is your favourite game and why? And yeah, if you, if you feel like you've already answered this or something similar, just go with your second favourite. Because it's always interesting to know. But yeah, today it's going to be a mighty chill episode. Commentary is probably going to be um, a little more relaxed. Because it is, it is like, what, like almost 10 p.m. now for me it's it's a lot later on the day and i don't i very rarely record at this sort of hour it's mainly because i literally couldn't record earlier in the day it was too hot like i've not been able to do much work today i've not really been able to focus on much i've not been able to game because it is just too hot and and some of you out there may be thinking oh well that's like nothing compared to the heat that um that i see in my country and it's very true that other countries do get significantly hotter but one thing you have to consider, the UK has zero infrastructure for heat. Like, no buildings. Like, almost no buildings. There is a few exceptions, but almost no buildings. Certainly not my flat. Certainly not most people's houses have air conditioning. It, you just have to deal with the heat. And we have, like, a fan, just in case it gets hot sometimes. So we only have one fan. It's not particularly good. You can hear it in the background, but it's not a particularly good fan. We're, like, burning through ice. All the shops are, like, literally ransacked for anything. Any liquid, any drink. There's just been completely ransacked out of every shop. It's it's kind of insane, actually. It's, yeah, it's kind of insane. Um, So, yeah, while some people out there will definitely be saying, oh, I deal with hotter all the time, or I deal with similar heats all the time, I guarantee that a lot of you probably have infrastructure built in to resist that sort of heat. We we don't have anything like that, so it's really hit us quite hard. And yeah, no one no one in the UK is really prepared for it. Like I said, it was only two days of this extreme heat, and it's just it's just kind of nutty. I mean, I'm doing what what people in the UK tend to do, and just complaining about the weather. Basically, we have this strange problem in the UK. If we always complain when it's cold, because we hate the cold. But then when it's hot, we just complain anyways, because none of us can actually stand the heat, because we're just not used to it. So basically, it just ends up that we're just always complaining, pretty much regardless of the weather. <laughs> I mean, it, don't get me wrong, it is nice to have warm weather. 
but like when when there's like a like a hot breeze like like a hot wind or there's um might get restock actually or there's like um just the sun beating down on you with very little shade boy is it is it quite quite torturous it's it's pretty insane um secret room wise are we looking here maybe that was pretty bad angle but i still got it damn that's not great i'll i'll go for this though i was thinking what if it like spawned steam sale then um or the coupon and immediately re-rolled it and gave us like the archie or something that would have been pretty awesome but yeah i'll take restock just based on like how good our money uh money gaining has been so far Second secret room, we don't have much choice. We have a lot of bombs though, so I will suss it out. I will suss it out. I'm pretty sure this is it, right? Yeah. Du -du 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 -du. Suicide King. I, I hope I don't accidentally kill myself with that, but that's actually kind of an interesting pickup. I do quite like a Suicide King. I do quite like it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. But yeah, I gotta say so. It's just it's just one of those things where I have been enjoying the heat. It's been nice. I've been going out playing a bit of Pokemon Go, but I can't stay out for long because I just I just can't stand it. My body is not built. It's not built to last. I'm not fit for purpose. It's it's just crazy. We don't have a trinket right now, so we'll grab that bad boy. So yeah, I I do apologize if the commentary leaves a bit to be desired. I would um I'd hope that. For you guys, it's not so bad. I'm really trying my best. Uh, but, at the same time, the heat is getting to me. But, on the opposite side of it, I had my parents over this weekend, so I didn't end up recording over the weekend, hence why my backlog is a little light. Which means I can't really afford to not record, because... Like, I would just take a day off today, because it's so warm, but I can't really afford to not record, because I basically, I need, like, a healthy-ish backlog of, realistically, I like to keep it at a bare minimum of five videos, so I'm, I'm hoping to get it back up to that level soon-ish. Oh, this is, this is really frustrating. We have so many means in which to use red hearts and no way to use them. Oh my lord, I'm taking some dumb damage. Um... Yeah, just because um, if I ever get ill out of the blue, I really like having like a, a, a nice solid backlog to rely on, just just in case. I'll take the Red Rune for now, just because we have no use for the Suicide King yet, and the Red Rune could genuinely be useful this floor, or basically on any other floor, I'd rather take it with me. Suicide King's niche, but it could be good. Angman is literally useless. Getting a lot of um, custom rooms here. Okay. Take your time, fella. You take your time. And yeah, I, I'm just I'm just trying to keep afloat, make sure I'm ready. We got a rainbow heart there. We are getting just the most means of getting red hearts ever. It's going to give me like three blood banks on this floor as well, isn't it? And not a single red heart. I can just feel it. I can just feel it. Red rune. Red rune's actually, I think, a pretty, pretty good use case here. I'll take that. A little bit of additional damage coming um, coming out of us. Yeah, I don't. I didn't actually check what this wisp would do. I don't know if Red Rune coincides with the Bis Plus Plus's EID descriptions. I would guess not, just because they're two completely separate mods. But that would be a pretty interesting little cross mod support thing there. I don't know if it's plausible, but it would be interesting. And then shop wise, I've definitely got a, an active here that I much prefer, so I'm gonna grab that. Um, this is an active that I think is really good. I'm definitely going to go and bomb you as well. Because I think that the more money we can get, the better. Just with restock going on, it makes a lot of sense. Yeah, I really like this, uh, this active. Rocks fall passively while we're holding it. They also adopt our tier effects. And then we can activate it to make more fall. Now, it is, a, it is an item that's known to cause a little bit of lag here and there. But I think with the reduced mod load that I've got going on right now, it should hopefully be not too bad. I'm actually kind of pleased that that golden penny didn't mess me around there, I'll be honest. Oh, but yeah, like today, I, I stayed out the heat for the most part, um, but I did decide to, um, I said I decided, I had to go into the office for, for a brief amount of time for work. I do work from home for the most part, but sometimes I have to go into the office to do various things. I have to test something for something I've got to do tomorrow at the office. Oh, I'm getting hit soon. True. Um, yeah, and I didn't have to go, but I decided to, and I regretted it so bad. I only live about 20 minutes walk away, but that walk, oh boy, that walk was pretty brutal. Yeah, so now for a short amount of time, it's gonna rain. As you can see, it rained for a short amount of time there. It's not a particularly great item damage-wise, but the fact that it can adopt tier effects is really what gives it 
a reason for existing and a reason to take up your space bar slot. It can really be a super cool synergistic thing. Also, I just really like the uh, the passive effect of it, like dropping rocks. I think it it adds a lot to a run. Nice. We did get our angel deal here. Uh, I, mean, I don't really know what I'm looking for here. Ungems donation machine, don't care about that. Um, donation, using donation machine, don't care about that. Taking damage makes you drop coins, pretty good. Enemies can pick up coins and become charmed. Pretty bad item. Are you kidding me? Okay, thank God. <laughs> I walked out and then realized and I was I was kind of shitting myself there. I'm not going to do the angel fight because I just don't think we're strong enough right now. 37 cent though, is real nice here. Hopefully we can get some actual passive items from the shop coming up. Yeah, I don't think the rocks that fall actually fall towards enemies. I think it is truly random. We're not going to get anything like that going on, but still. Uh, Magician there's rather, rather nice. A justice. We're getting a lot of, like, free soul hearts here that are keeping us afloat, so never going to say no to that. But yeah, uh, Magician here is really good just for the range upgrade. The homing is obviously a big part of it as well, but the range upgrade is pretty spicy. Ow. Lost that soul heart already. Not really an item I want, but there you go. Obsessed fan, thank you, I guess. Oh, come on now, game. Oh, this this fly slows. I just realised. Nice. We can't upgrade it now. I, I didn't think we'd be able to, but I have to check. Pop that. Get some fall. You see, you see the lag? It's a, especially when you pop it, you do get a little, little bit of a frame drop, especially on large rooms. Take a pill here. Kind of needing it. A range upgrade's very nice. What does this guy do again? I don't remember. I'm noticing that range upgrade already. Did that, that rock fall and break that mushroom there? Is that what happened? Damn it, in these large rooms, it's not actually that effective. As you can see, like, none of them really fell near the middle where the enemies are. But they're still falling and doing a good job. They're still hitting things. Yeah, good. Last guy left. A little bit tricky, what we got there. And yeah, I'm just having, having a nice chill one. I'm having a nice chill one. I've been wanting to play more Elden Ring recently like a lot more i've been oh god that bomb was hit me uh, i've been like really really wanting to play more of it so this these should hurt in some way or another the range of great uh, oh god how did i dodge that oh but now we've got him firing rocks and then rocks falling it's confusing okay we got it, we got it. just the box really not not a lot of great stuff for us here i will take sirens um lullaby here just in case Keep her going. I'll take the pill as well. Eh, that's actually pretty good. I'll take that. I'll take that. Keep her going. Yeah, um, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah, I've been wanting to play a lot more Elden Ring recently, but i got to say, the past few days, the heat. Like, I feel like Elden Ring's one of those games as well where you do have to kind of commit to it. You can't just, like, pop on for a little bit here and there. You kind of have to be okay with playing it for, like, a solid two hours. Oh. Now that... That is a... That is a temptation right there. I have to say, that is that is something that that lures me in. I don't know why I pressed that so early. I'm stupid. I pressed it, and I don't know. I thought it'd last the whole room or something, and I'm stupid. God. I didn't realise there was burnies and clickety clacks, and it confused the hell out of me. My bad. My bad. I did just get finished up watching. I actually, this evening's been really nice. I finished work and I met up with my girlfriend and a few people that she works with at a bar. Had some drinks just because it's nice and hot out. So we stayed out on sort of the outside porch bit and had some drinks. It was very refreshing. Um, would love that, but I really like my active right now. Um, I, I don't know. I'm tempted by it though. I am. We'll see what tier effects we get this floor. If we get a tier effect that really makes this worth it, I think I might stick with this. But. If not, I think the D1 is going to be the thing that gives us the win. There's an eternal heart there as well. Uh, yeah, and then um, and then we went to the park because um, it cooled off a little bit since then. We waited until it cooled off. 
went to the park um, and ordered a takeaway to the park. It was very, very nice. Really, another Eternal one of these? You better give me Eternal Heart as well, fella. This is a really awful room for this as well. The Isaac's Tears? Really? With the Isaac's Tears? Game. Are you, are you seeing the, the shiitake you're forcing on me right now? Uh, yeah, I went to the park, had a nice little takeaway, it was really, really nice. Um, just me and my girlfriend had a nice sit down, it was lovely. Then we came home, we got ourselves an ice foot bath. Um, ooh, that's gonna help. That's gonna help. BFF? I don't think BFF does it for us. Um, it's not, our, it's not our last floor for either. If BFF increased the chance for us to um, spawn familiars, then I'd take it. But I don't actually know if it does. Um, yeah, and I came back, got a nice ice foot bath. was very, very nice. Had an ice cream, uh, like a little ice lolly sort of thing. And um, watched the new episode of Better Call Saul. And my god, it was depressing. Yeah, but in a good way. <laughs> I don't know how many of you out there are watching Better Call Saul right now or have watched it at all. I don't care who you are. I don't care whether you like Breaking Bad or not. But watch Better Call Saul. It is one of the best TV shows I have ever seen. It is absolutely incredible. It's it's insane how good it is. And I'm enjoy it's it's the last it's the last half of the last season and I am enjoying it so much. Oh my health. Pretty tragic right now. Pretty tragic right now. Worrying me somewhat. Worrying me. Do I want to go back to these other rooms? I'm going to gamble on the 1% chance for a planetarium. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, do you know what? I got the eternal heart here at least. That's something. And I got hit... Oh my god, we finally got a red heart, but still, that wasn't great. What makes you larger? Is Does what make you larger increase the size of our beam at all? I don't think it does, does it? Ooh, a soul of Cain. Okay, that, this could provide. And it did. Yes, please. Now BFF is worth it, right? Now BFF is worth it. Sadly, I don't think the Siren's Lullaby is really going to do much for us here. But BFF, Blood Puppy, hell yeah. Hell to the yes. Right, let's be on our way. In fact, one minute, one minute, one minute, one minute, one minute. Grab that real quick. I don't know why a full card rock has spawned on Necro 1, but it has. Odd. Very odd. Right. Snake our way back around, because I might be able to steal a boss rush thing. Because I haven't done boss rush yet, but I will say... I don't know why I went through the middle there. That scared the bejeebus out of me. Um, I'm going to go Light Path. Oh, I tapped it by accident. It doesn't matter. It's gone. <laughs> Uh, I was going to say, we're going to make it in time, definitely. But yeah, I just, um, I, I didn't mean to do that, I promise. BFF now, to chunk up my boy. Blue map for 21, considering we have 21 left, seems like a good idea. Um, I know I'm taking a bit of extra time, considering I just said I wanted to go to Boss Rush. But honestly, I need, need some more HP. And I think Secret Rooms, while not the best way to do it, are a good way to do it. Take that with me. Want, want, want. Want, 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 want. I was saying I was scared about going through the middle of those, but I've actually just realised that if you have flight, it's definitely, definitely the way you should be doing that. <clears throat> I'm you, boy. Yeah, I'll see if I need to use my crown of greed or not. See what the shop holds for us. I'm sad we never really got anything that, that made, um, that made our active, like, truly pop. But, it's still doing well. I'll keep my chunky boy alive, doing his thing. Really, you're gonna give me a devil deal at this hour? I will sacrifice you, my boy. Don't make me do it. Uh, I wouldn't do that to you. I, I, I wouldn't and I couldn't. You will evolve. You will become the greatest god I've ever seen.
You can be my hero, baby. You can take my breath away. That guy was a rainbow boy. Uh, we got two different various hearts here. Breaking rocks is a chance to drop hearts. That sounds incredible. And turns... Yeah, well, let's, let's go with that. I know that I'm going to accidentally destroy my child. His fat, fat lips, but... Okay, black heart achieved. Rainbow baby, hell yes. Let's try this out. That did not do anything even remotely good for us. My sweet, sweet, chunky boy. You need to be calm, my lad. You must be calm. He's been quenched. He's been quenched. His anger subsides. Oh my god, really? That again? Okay. I'm gonna take this, actually. I want Rainbow Baby to be firing like a mad lad. He was doing mad damage though, so we need to get him we need to get him into rage mode again, I think. Come on, dude. Okay, that works. Chariot's there. Another black heart. We keep getting these black hearts back over and over. What is going on here? There's there's so many hands. That was an insane amount of hands. I need to find my shop first. As much as I want to make this work, my shop is valuable. This is a shop. Uh, Rerolls items into items from a random pool with a random cost. Interesting. So let's pop that. We only got one, which is probably preferable. Let's go for it. Let's give it a go. With all your money. Okay, do it. Yes. Take it. Let's go. Okay. See if we can kill you in time, but I don't think we're going to be able to. Actually, I don't know. With that damage, we might be able to. Yeah, we should be able to. But good. No angel deal, sadly. We're going to go light path. We're going to check this out. Oh, God, we don't know. There's golden troll bombs in here. Are you kidding me, Captain? This is a quality four item, though. It's Curse Die. Okay, Curse Die? Oh, this is probably a bad idea. Curse Die, I actually think, might be a really good thing for us to grab here. Just because we can just get a lot of black hearts generated throughout this whole shebang. This guy is taking quite the beating. God, the boss armor on this boy. It's insane. I want to release this one from its cage so it can start dealing damage to enemies. There you go, it's out, it's out. Soul heart there, nice. Oh lord. Yeah, I think the gold control bombs are somehow good. I don't know how another one got one of them got relocked back in its cage. Dude, this is an insane amount of spiders. What the hell is going on here? Spawning the spiders, my ladder? Is it you? Oh my god. This guy is proving to be quite the issue, isn't he? How how does the troll bombs keep getting caught back in there again? How are you doing this? It's it's like a cage that you can't get out of. How'd you get back into it? Why would you want to be back into it? You're useless from in there. You can't deal damage to me or the enemy. 
This is... This siren is... Whoa, what the hell? What's all this? The siren's insane. I don't know what's going on. I have literally no idea what's going on with this siren. Oh my lord. The lad. He is one. Okay, this is... A bit nutty. The one good thing is I do have like a protective shell in the middle here to keep myself away from major harm. I'm kind of just letting Blood Puppy do his thang. He seems pretty, pretty knowledgeable. He seems to know how to slap ass quite bigly. Take care of him for me. He doesn't really know how to charge the cage, though, here. He's kind of bouncing off of him. These these golden troll bombs. Dude, why are you in here? Why are you in here? You with your big butt. Dude, go after the other boss, my lad. He's over here, look. I am not the enemy. Thank you. My sweet summer child. Yeah, this thing in the middle that they've created here, actually super useful. By the way, I came in here thinking, ooh, I'm going to gain some items and some health. So far, I got an item that gives me health and have gained quite literally zero HP over what I was at. I keep giving myself half a black heart and then immediately losing it. These bombs are going are gonna to call my boy. It's okay. Get. Yeah. Okay, nice. Him plus the golden troll bombs. A match made in heaven. Not an eternal enemy I would want to deal with today. I guess we don't have much of a choice. Dude. Blood puppy. Why? Every time, my boy, every time. What did I tell you about this? And every time an enemy disappears, Blood Puppy's like, oh, like that. <laughs> he comes charging in. He comes bounding over. I hate the Matriarch with a burning passion, so... Hey, I've got invincibility for a little bit. Try and use it. I don't know how long I have it for, but let's make the most of it. Go, ass sna snatcher. Ow, I ran out of invincibility while I stood on top of an enemy. Nice. I love just the noise, the ding 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 of the golden troll bombs just doing their thing. Are you stuck, my sir? Thank you. Ready for him. I'm ready. He's gonna come. Where are you? Okay. We got a lucky penny there. One of our pieces of luck returned to us. A pieces of luck? What's a piece of luck? You know what I mean. Okay. You do you, my boys. Oh my god. <laughs> How is this not over yet? It's been going on for so long. How has he not, like, devolved yet, either? He's taken so much damage. A must have, at least. I, I, I don't actually know how much he's taken. Why does this guy not have a coming down thing? The mod coming down doesn't work on this guy's feet. This guy's feet are like the most annoying thing in the world. Oh, damn it. Get the half heart back and it disappears every single time. 
Sure, sit next to the troll bomb. You fool. You absolute fool. This this was a journey. This took a lot longer than it should have. Really? Really? And we got another active item, so... I mean, we got the completion mark, but apart from that, that was all... Just a big bunch of bollocks. Just a huge bunch of bollocks. I mean, we leveled up our boy. That holds some merit. Come on, sir. Just let him deal with everything from now on. He will be our hero, as I said. Oh, why don't the bloody doors work anymore? They broke door mimics in the last patch. Uh, did I charm him? What does this even mean? What is it? I'm not sure what it means if he's charmed. I really should have kept the thing that meant destroying rocks to give us stuff, because he is destroying rocks left, right, and center. Oh, wait. What? Now that he's charmed, he can't hurt me? I think it's because he picked up a coin from charity. Oh, Mr. Dolly. Um, ooh, this is, a, this is a tough decision. Do I take Mr. Dolly or do I roll? Yeah, I think it's because of charity. That's an interesting interaction. I think I'm going to roll. I think I need... Mr. Dolly is good, but I need something better. So now now he's full he's full killer and we don't have to worry about it anymore. Kind of interesting. Oh, wait. No, no, no. We should take Mr. Dolly, actually. I just realized. We should take Mr. Dolly. Because I've just realized... Also, let's go one we'll make you larger again. Why not? Um, the... Unfortunately, we're not going to know what the item is because of our uh, crown when we reroll it. So, I will take that. And I'm very happy I did. Thank you. Come on, fella. Uh, so, such an, a unique and interesting interaction here. And I, it looks as if he can't take damage anymore, maybe? Yeah, it looks as if he maybe can't take damage anymore too, which is insane. He's just stuck up full level with BFF. That's quite a crazy little uh, accident that's happened here. That's befallen us. We have a sun card. That's actually really good for the next floor. But yeah, he's just going to wreck these bosses, right? And there's nothing we can do to hurt him. This is mega. Active items? Can you actually go the hell away? Can you actually go the hell away, active items? It's getting really frustrating at this point. No one cares about you. Here comes the sun. And he's still charmed in the next floor as well. For his beat or whatever caused this. I think, I, I think it was charity. I think... It said enemies can become charmed when they pick up a, a coin. I think that's what's happened. Did, dude, that was my bomb. Did you have to? Okay, he can't quite reach you. He's trying his hardest, but he just can't quite. No thank you with the foot. Actually, I don't know. No. I, see, I was thinking, a full room reroll could be good because... Specifically because it might, because we've now charmed him, it might let us keep our boy. But I, I, do, I just don't know. I just don't know. Also, this teleport was AIDS. We've gone so far away. I'm gonna skip through some rooms here because I can't be asked. What? Stop pushing my bombs. What in the hell? No, no, no. Black sack. Some bombs. Oh, a range upgrade there. It's kind of nice. Range up. But yeah, worm friend now with BFF as well. Dude, stop pushing my bombs out the way, you big fat dick. 
You're such a chunky boy and you know it. Like even the even the spike blocks are doing hurt him. Pretty mega. Pretty mega. Okay. Go after him, my boy. Wreak havoc. Knew I was taking damage there. More of the void, nine lives. Nine lives is pretty decent here. Do I wanna go hush? Seems like a really bad idea. But also what's going on with my eyes? I feel like it's a really bad idea and therefore I have to do it. I reckon we can let our boy take most of the fall. Smart fly. Both quality falls. Polly. Fire rate, pretty dead. But Polly is pretty good for us here. Vigil of knowledge. Get along the line, my boy. Get along the line. Join us. Come on. Down here, down here, down here. And this way, this way. Nice. Up this way. Back down. Up this way. <laughs> I, I'm so stupid. <laughs> you guys saw that coming, didn't you? Okay, back this way, back this way. Eat. Up this way. Up this way. Damn you. I trained you to be the chompiest boy. Hive mind is decent enough here. I upgraded nine lives apparently there. Okay, come on Chonka, it's time. Show me what you got. I mean it's eternal, so that's that's a real barrel of laughs. This is gonna be bad. We's going to die. Stop teleporting, Gim. This isn't, this isn't even the real fight. Stop. Dude. Dude, it chased me. I mean, Smart Fly's active now. That's good, I guess. I just want my, my big fat boy to get stuck on him, but he keeps bouncing off of him. Oh, we're so bloody flecked, aren't we? I mean, the damage we're doing is pretty insane. But I still feel like, regardless, even with, like, Smart Fly, BFF, my, my bloody boy, the attack patterns, the fury that's coming at us here, what is unfolding today, it might be too much. I don't know if I can withstand the heat. That certainly doesn't help. I didn't realize there was flies coming at me. Ooh, although Revet, do you know, I'm pretty sure the revenge item, the very first item we got this run, does percent base damage. So in getting hit, we dealt, we dealt a massive chunk of his health bar as damage there. Interesting. Interesting indeed. That, that kind of saved us. Us getting hit multiple times and me thinking I was losing, was actually the only reason we won. <laughs> Go. Go, my child. Go. Save me, boy. Thank you. It's okay. He's got my back. He's got my back. Oh, apparently he spawns red hearts every now and again. I didn't know that. Oh, I, although I no, I'm gonna say I'm not gonna say that. I did know that. I just forgot. The damage we deal is also pretty pretty awesome. Good. good. I do wonder. Can he kill these things? He can. I don't know why I didn't think he'd be able to, but. I'm curious. Oh, what the hell? What did that? What happened with that dude? 
How'd you get into the middle there, son? How'd that happen? Dropping rainbow hearts. Wow. <laughs> Annihilation. Oh god, no! For some reason I didn't see that thing about to fire. I didn't consider it an actual enemy, I don't know why. Don't you telefrag me. Oh, I'm definitely gonna die at least once in the room. My charge times are just way too high. This is scary. Very, very scary. Nope. Not dealing with whatever that room was trying to throw at me there. Don't wanna. Dude. Dude. Stop. He did it again. Stop. That was my bomb. Right, you're gonna have to kill Isaac here, because I bloody well can't do it, so... I wish you good luck, my, my, my fine, fine gentleman, my fine sir. The thing is, Revenge isn't gonna play as big a... Look at, look at the damage Revenge did there. But Revenge isn't gonna play anywhere near as big of a role here. I got an extra soul out for some reason. At least hand-me-downs will get some use if I die here. Now nah, we can do this, we can do this, we've got enough attempts. Get him into the next phase, and that will, that will help a lot. It won't make things a guaranteed win, because honestly, I can't really see, but it'll help. <clears throat> honestly, my, my worm friend is really the star of the show here. Held him down, locked him down. Oh my god. <laughs> this has been quite a stressful one, considering I was like, I'm just going to have a chill episode today. And my crown didn't work there, so... Mutant Spider, I, I genuinely don't think we can take. Cancer is pretty much a must. Familiar which hurts enemies, that sounds good. These two can get re-rolled. What the heck? <laughs> when it said random cost, I was not expecting that. That's interesting. I like the idea behind this uh, re-roll a lot. I was not expecting that when it said random cost. That is a free one-up for one hit of damage. I feel like that has to be a good purchase, right? I know I already have a lot of thingies one-ups technically, but I don't know. That feels that feels better. I should really go the way of the other... Um... Oh, my God. Ooh, lad. Hell yes. Yeah, I should really go the way of the other um, secret room, to be honest. That is more than likely to be where we're supposed to be going. The damage output right now. It's nutty. But 57 damage. Some rooms just die instantly. One of those was a death boy, so a lot of death there. And death again. There was an item in there. Should have gone and got that. Kind of forgot these guys charge you down. That's a really beautiful rainbow, though. Demon baby. Nice. Demon baby. Quickly check this out. And then we'll try the boss. I got, we got good health. We just got cancer as well. I feel like that's going to be a big get for us. It's just a sentence that is so strange to say. We got red key out of this. We got butt bombs. I guess I'll give red key a chance to shine. And I'm going to pop this. Jumper cables and 45 cent mum's perfume. Honestly worth paying, but <laughs> not right now because we do not have anything close to that amount of money. No, that was such a bad hit. I lost 11.51 damage for that blunder. Not that it's going to matter, but still. Not that it should matter is what I'm going to say, actually. 
Let's not be too confident here. Things could still go wrong. Goddamn demon, baby. Look at the shot. Look at the fire rate. The size of those shots. Goddamn BFF plus the siren's um, lullaby. God damn. Damn, demon, baby. You thick. Maybe if I get hit, revenge will just insta-kill him. Let's find out. No. I think it's based, it's based on a percent of how much health they currently have. So the higher their HP, the more damage it does. Anyways, we'll close that one out. Not as easy as I thought it was going to be, but either way, a fun one. I hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys in the next one.